It's been a wonderful journey to see the transformation happen in healthcare and specifically within individual problems like sepsis, for example. I think with sepsis, the change for physicians has been that until recently, there was no standardized pathway to treat patients. We've done a lot to build um, awareness and education for the staff and physicians how to recognize it, asking each hospital to have a sepsis response plan in place. If we suspect sepsis, we want to give those antibiotics because it's so important not to miss that time window. We have also built tools in our um, electronic health record to help get that care started. So we have something called a power plan, which is a bundle of orders that the doctor can pull up and everything in the evidence-based bundle is built into it so they can just check, 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 check. Some things are pre-checked so that we assure that those items are done like blood testing and blood cultures and antibiotics, etc. The effort that has gone in across this country, utilizing apps, engaging leaders, and providing, frankly, simple, easy, uh, approaches to clinical staff at the bedside to say, think sepsis. We have seen a significant reduction in my own organization of mortality from sepsis, and we're super proud of it. This past year alone, and we're a very large organization, but we saved 820 lives in our reduced mortality rate across our hospitals.